Hello and welcome to another tutorial of Excel BI. Today I want to show you how to perform cross join also known as Cartesian join. You can use this technique in Microsoft Excel or Power BI using Power Query tool. This tutorial is divided into three sessions. Understanding cross join, specific examples where you need to perform cross join, how to perform cross join. So let's start the video. In Power Query, there are six types of joins and these joins require common columns in both queries. However, with cross join, we can generate a pair of combination of each row of first table with each row of second table without having a common column. You can use cross join in different scenarios such as where you want to generate a price list for a set of customers that include audio products where you want to generate a sample data. We have been provided with the country and product table and an output table that show combination of each country and product. We will perform cross join in five simple steps. Step 1. Import country and product table in Power Query and load it as connection. To do so, make sure you have converted your data into table. Now from data tab, Get and transform data, click on from table and ranges. It will open a Power Query editor and load your table in Power Query. Once your table has been loaded in Power Query, click on close and load button and select close and load to. Select only credit connection option. Perform the same task for product table. Step 2. Create a reference query. I am using country query. Right click and click on reference. We can see a reference query. Update the query name to cross join. Step 3. Create a custom column. For that, go to add column. Click on custom column. And here, write the other query name. Since we have used country query to create the reference query, we are going to write product Query name. Remember, Power Query is case sensitive. Make sure that you write the correct spelling with the correct case. Step 4. Once we have performed these three steps, we will get this new column. Click on this expand button, uncheck use original column as prefix, and select the columns that you would like to show in your cross join query. Since we have only one column, therefore I am selecting the product name column. Click OK and here we can find all the combination of country and products. Step 5. As a final step, load this query in your Excel worksheet as a table. For that, go to Home, Close and Load, Close and Load and here we have our cross join query in front of us. In case you don't find this panel, go to your data tab, from the queries and connection, select this query and connection option. This option will enable this panel and will disable this panel. If you find this tutorial helpful, make sure you let me know by leaving a comment and a thumbs up below. You can also give your suggestion for future videos in comments. See you in next tutorial.